Hi there, students. Desultory. Okay, desultory is an adjective. It, we use it in various different ways. I think for me, the first meaning is something that's disappointing. Yeah, it's poor quality, not very good progress. So we made desultory progress. We made a little bit of progress, but it wasn't very good quality and it wasn't really very much. Yeah, I had hoped for a lot more. Desultory can also mean not connected, not connected with the subject. Yeah, um, so he made one or two desultory comments that were nothing to do with what we were talking about. Okay, and the last way we use desultory means jumping from one thing to another, not methodical, not connected. So his, uh, he wrote a very desultory report. The report wasn't organized. He'd suddenly talk about one thing and then suddenly talk about another and then go back to the first one and then mention a third one. OK, so there's no pattern, no organisation, no structure. So he gave a desultory speech. Maybe it was disappointing. It wasn't very good, but it also perhaps wasn't connected. Yeah, there was no overall a uh, theme that ran from one thing to another. <coughs> it jumped uh, from one place to another and then back without any uh, really good pattern. Yeah, it was unmethodical, if you like. OK, so disappointing. I managed a desultory 16th place in the competition rather disappointing. I'd hoped for more. Yeah. Um, he tidied the room in a desultory way. Notice desultory is an adjective. If you want to make it into an adverb, you have to say in a desultory way. So he tidied the room in a desultory way. He did a bit over here and a bit over there. It was disorganized and haphazard. It was not methodical at all. OK, and yeah, um, there were a few desultory items on my desk, things that were not connected with my work. Yeah, maybe there was a football and uh, half a pound of bird seed and uh, OK, some leaves. Yeah, these are nothing to do with the job of a, an English teacher. Yeah, so there it's disjointed. It's uh, there's no pattern to them. They're not really part of a working environment. OK, so desultory. It means with no plan, with no push or enthusiasm, maybe a bit half hearted. Yeah, or something that's very random or haphazard that jumps from one thing to another, something disconnected. Yeah, it could be very unmethodical or vague. Yeah, there's no real pattern or organization or structure. And then desultory, something that's disappointing, it's not very good quality. Yeah, you haven't progressed very much. Yeah. So he's in his he, he's he's uh, in his desultory study of English. He didn't study the language methodically and he wasn't really terribly interested or motivated in it. OK, so remember, desultory is an adjective. If you want to use it as an adverb in a desultory way. Now you're going to want to know about formality. This is quite a formal word. I'd probably give it something like 7 out of 10 in formality. It's certainly good for a formal writing. I think probably it's not so suitable for an informal conversation. So in an informal conversation, what would I say? Disappointing. 
random, disconnected, something like that. Those words would be more suitable in an informal conversation. Okay, so desultory, disappointing, not very good, rather poor quality, but not very uh, well thought out or something that is not connected it's not got an overall plan it's very random in a random way yeah and then the last one um jumping from one subject to another yeah something that is not connected maybe okay or the last meaning something that is not connected with the subject that we are talking about so, to make a desultory comment, it's a lovely day today, isn't it? Yeah, there's nothing to do with this video. It's a desultory comment. Okay, and I hope the organisation of this video wasn't desultory. Yeah, okay, I hope it was well formatted. And I also hope it was uh, better than a desultory quality, a poor quality. So, enough. If you enjoyed the video, give it a rating, subscribe to my channel, and I'll see you soon. Bye for now. Desultry.